the Bible says a lot about the wrath of God, his judgment and condemnation for several vital reasons. First of all, because this is essential to the very nature of God, that God is not just loving and merciful and gracious, but he is a holy and just and righteous God. And so in talking about the wrath of God, it helps us to know God better. And God is perfect and all of his perfections are in perfect harmony with one another. And his wrath is essential to understanding who he is and how, how we are to know him. Likewise, the Bible talks to us about the wrath of God and the judgment of God and the condemnation of God because these are essentials not only to understanding God better, but understanding the gospel. The gospel is good news and glad tidings, but it begins with very bad news. The bad news is that God is holy and we are not, and we will have to answer to God for how we have lived our lives. And there's no good thing in us to commend to God no good works we perform can live up to God's righteous standards. It is these, these truths that bring man, bring us to an end of ourselves. And when we recognize that God and his wrath is our problem, then we are introduced to the good news that what God demands in perfect righteousness, God provides in the person and work of the Lord Jesus Christ. The God who is the problem is the solution. And so it's vital for our understanding of who God is. And the wrath of God is essential for understanding the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ.